Born into slavery, Robert Smalls earned the trust of his captors on the waterways of Charleston, South Carolina. Hired as pilot and chief crewman of an armed Confederate transport named the Planter, his meager wage was not enough to buy his family's freedom. On the night of May 12, 1862, while the officers were ashore, Robert set his long-awaited plan into action. He commandeered the ship, picked up his family and other slaves, and headed for freedom. Mimicking the captain and using secret hand signals, he steered past Confederate checkpoints and headed towards the Union blockade. Union warships were seconds from firing when Small swapped the flag with a white bedsheet, signaling surrender and greeted with cheers. Despite a $4,000 bounty on his head, he became a national phenomenon and captain of the planter. He fought in 17 battles against the Confederates who never forgot the name. Robert Smalls.